I am so glad we don't have to deal with those things. That is rough for sure. We've got some clouds out there tonight. That is about it. Not that bad a day. 74 degrees Burlington right now. Dew point at 54. It feels really nice out there. All right, other temperatures. Well, low 70s for some, like in Newport, also in Montpelier. Look at this. Saranac Lake right now at just 64 degrees. Storm Tracker 5000, where it's just 64 degrees. We're seeing a lot of clouds, but I got to show you something. We've got rain out there as you go, just north of the border, parts of Ontario, also into Quebec. Rain showers and this stuff, if it stays together, I think it's going to clip parts of St. Lawrence County eventually into Franklin County. We'll see what happens here. Best chances for a few isolated showers, we're thinking tonight in northern New York. Now, we've had this upper level low pressure system that continues to hang around, just kind of cranking around, and that will affect our weather as we get into tomorrow. We'll talk more about that in just a minute. I want to give you an update out in the Atlantic Ocean. Erica is still out there. Tropical storm. Winds right now sustained at 45 miles an hour. So this is the updated forecast from the National Hurricane Center. We give you the advisory from 5 o'clock. So we're going to put this thing into motion. It looks like it's going to be pretty weak. That's the thinking. But note, it's got more of a turn on it than it did even earlier today. So forecasters thinking not so much the center of this cone going toward Miami, but a little bit farther up the peninsula of Florida. Now we'll see if this trend continues, if it continues to move on off to the north as it comes on off to the west. So it'll be interesting. If it continues to move, it may affect uh, even the Carolinas over time here. Now, here's the thing. It does look like it strengthens as it gets a little bit closer to Florida as the forecast stands right now, and it does become a minimal hurricane. So, a lot of stuff to watch. We will, of course, continue to do that for you. A little bit closer to home, look at this. We've got this upper-level low-pressure system. We've got a low right along the coast here. So, this trough is going to move on through. Just the chance for a few isolated showers tonight, and I think the same thing during the day tomorrow, then the day after that, finally. High pressure pressure is going to settle in, and it's going to be real nice by then. This is Futurecast, 715 tonight. Maybe the odd isolated shower, as I say. We'll take you through the overnight. And here comes your Friday as we're all getting set for the weekend. I think we find a lot of clouds around first thing in the morning, but we end up with a partly sunny day and certainly the chance again for a few isolated rain showers around. I think most of us see a whole lot of nothing, but just be aware that it could happen. We do clear tomorrow night, and then by Friday, we are golden. So partly cloudy tonight. A few isolated showers. Again, we're seeing a little bit, especially off to the west right now. 58 degrees, that'll do you for a low tonight. For tomorrow, just a little bit cooler than today. 75 in Burlington, 74 in Plattsburgh. It becomes partly sunny after we see a lot of clouds first thing in the morning. A few isolated showers, certainly a possibility. Up and down the Connecticut Valley, temperatures approaching the mid 70s, if not just a little bit better than that. Now, in the Champlain Valley, first thing tomorrow morning, temperatures not far from 60 degrees. A lot of clouds around, does become partly sunny. I think the best chances for a few isolated showers will be during the afternoon. 75, that'll do it. Champlain Valley tomorrow to 57 tomorrow night. I like Friday a lot. Mostly sunny skies, 77 degrees. Saturday, it's a mix of sun and clouds, 80. Sunday, I think it's going to be partly sunny, but the chance for a couple of showers in there. We'll see how this all pans out. 79 degrees. Watch what happens here, though. Monday, partly sunny, 82. Tuesday, Wednesday, looking good. See a lot of sunshine. Gets warmer, too. The high on Tuesday, 84. The high on Wednesday, 85.